welcome to my channel and I'm back with you once again with another video of Microsoft Flight Simulator 24. Nowadays, I'm exploring the Enables Airbus A350-1000 in the simulator and in this regard, I'm uh, planning to make a series of videos of this plane so that uh, I can just explore all the functionalities of this plane and break it down into different videos which will make it easy for you to look for specific information on my channel. I will give you all the links uh, of the videos in the description and you can just uh, follow any of the video as per your choice. And now in this video, I will show you how to connect uh, the EFB of this plane with your SimBrief and Navigraph account. Because uh, this is an Enables plane and it requires uh, uh, a SimBrief account uh, and you have to make a flight plan in the SimBrief and then you can import it in the EFB and configure the FMS. So for this, uh, you have to go to this uh, EFB and from here you have to go to Options and in Options, you have to go to this Option Third Party. And over here, you can uh, put in your SimBrief user ID and uh, you can also uh, link this EFB with the Navigraph because uh, with the Navigraph charts, uh, this uh, ANF will work, which is airport navigation function of this plane. You can see the terminal chart over here on the navigation display. And plus, uh, you have uh, this option of, you know, accessing the Navigraph charts over here. So let's get back. And uh, for the SimBrief user ID, you can go to your SimBrief account. So in the account settings, uh, you will find uh, your pilot ID. And uh, you have to enter this pilot ID over there. So it's uh, 557363. And uh, for the Navigraph, just open it in the browser. Just click this option or you can also scan this uh, QR code with your mobile phone. Uh, but right now for this video, I'm using the browser and uh, simply sign in. I've already saved uh, the uh, email and the password. So I simply have to sign in and uh, just approve and allow and that's it. So now uh, the Navigraph and the SimBrief account is connected to the AFB and you can now access the terminal chart. Let's say right now I'm at uh, the King Khalid International Airport in Riyadh. So if I just put in the account code and search, now I can have all the charts for the approach, for the departure, and everything. And now I can also import uh, the flight plan from the SimBrief. So that's how you connect the EFB of this plane with the SimBrief and Navigraph account. Actually, I make videos uh, for the beginners because as a beginner, you struggle with many things. I've been struggling a lot as well. And obviously different planes in this uh, simulator have got different functionalities. So that's why uh, you have to just go through it. So hopefully this was a useful uh, video for you and uh, just uh, wait for more videos to be uploaded. If you're not subscribed to my channel, please do subscribe to it. Thank you very much for staying with me. Have a nice day. Hope to see you soon.